We used camera traps to study jaguars in the Maya Forest Corridor in Belize. This unprotected mosaic landscape of jungle, savanna, farms and villages forms the only viable connection between two core jaguar populations of the Selva Maya and the Maya Mountain Massive Forest Blocks. The continued existence of these two populations depends on the exchange of individuals, preventing inbreeding and allowing recolonization in the event of unexpected disasters. Over seven years we documented 60 jaguars using the corridor. We were surprised to find so many in this unprotected human-influenced landscape, approximately two jaguars for every 100 square kilometres. Male jaguars travelled further than females and were more likely to be killed by people, with the majority of deaths associated with livestock predation. Accordingly, the turnover of males in the area was higher than females, reflecting higher dispersal and death rates. In contrast, some females remained in the area for up to five years, and we detected courtship, pregnancy and cubs. The corridor is bisected by a highway. Crossings by jaguars were rare and male biased, raising concern that the highway could prevent female movement through the corridor if traffic volume increases. We highlight the critical importance of this landscape for jaguars, but its future is hanging in the balance. Continued deforestation and development of the corridor will impede the movement of jaguars into and out of the core populations of the Selva Maya and the Maya Mountain Massif. Under these conditions, the long-term existence of jaguar populations in the region will depend on appropriate land use planning, non-lethal control of livestock predators, regulation of game hunting, and wildlife-friendly features in future road developments.